welcome back to Beauty and Beyond. Now, before the break, we were talking about the importance of dressing up, accessorizing, etc. Now, let us move on to the next, which is, of course, we cannot forget, behavior. Now, ano ba talaga ang tamang behavior or pag-uugali? Now, I'm gonna make um, Dina answer that for first. Mm -mm, miscivility. <laughs> All right. right. Well, I, I'm very happy that I got acquainted with mm. civility. Civility. Yes, yes. Because yes. a few years back, I was appointed as co-ambassador, mm -hmm. co-chair of the Civility Ambassadors Program of AICI Philippine Chapter. So it was a very close connection with all the rules. Mm -hmm. And... It was the rules on etiquette, on well, manners. You know what, Abby? You'd be surprised. Etiquette is only a small portion of civility. Of civility. Yes, yes. Civility is a way of life. Civility is a way of thinking, a way of speaking. It's, mm -hmm. It permeates every aspect of our lives. It's not just because you know good manners, right? Mm -hmm. It's only a portion. Mm -hmm. uh, it's got to come from within the person, the good. So this is the, basically the character of the yes, person. Yes, the, the good in you. Yung character yes. ba, Dain? Yes. Na mabago pa ba yun? Y All right. <laughs> yes and no. Trick question. And yes and no. Okay. For people who are really very concerned about other people, mm -hmm. Yes, because they'll go out of their way, and even if it causes them, yes, it, it causes them effort, sometimes pain, mm -hmm. sacrifice, but because they don't want other people to think ill of them, and they want to be kinder, to be more considerate of others, so they'll go out of their way to change. Okay. But you know what? I've seen others who don't seem to care. I'm telling you. Mahirap When oh there my is goodness. no care, parang hindi na, yes. hindi na positive behavior. Even ano? if they realize they're in the wrong, they don't even say, excuse me, I'm sorry, I apologize. No. As simple as no. the magic words. No. They refuse. There are some people who refuse to apologize. Okay. They don't care whether you forgive them or not. They want to have their way at all times. There are people like that. That's right. Yeah. Now, Lee, with your experience of how many nations? Um, over 110 Over 110 mm -hmm. nations. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, masasabi mo, iba-iba ang culture mm -hmm. natin. So, iba-iba mm -hmm. rin ang behavior. Yes. yes. Um, now, what would be one culture or one behavior na nagsistand out based on your memory? You know what? In all the cultures, mm -hmm. we have the same thing basically okay. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. before it was the golden rule treat mm -hmm. people mm -hmm. the way mm -hmm. they the, want you uh, uh -oh. treat people the way you want to be treated yes. right mm -hmm. now it has actually evolved mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it has treat people the mm -hmm. way they want to be treated mm -hmm. again say that again huh? yes. treat people the, the way, way they, they want to be, be treated, treated. Mm -hmm. like but that's, how do you that know? is now the platinum rule Mm -hmm. It's no longer the golden it's no longer rule. The golden it's now the platinum, platinum rule. rule. I like that. That's oh, nice. It is I the like that. Really nice. <laughs> yes. Of course, developing an awareness mm -hmm. of mm -hmm. how you conduct yourself mm -hmm. when you're with others. Awareness. Say, mm -hmm. Awareness. Say, for example, cultural intelligence. Mm -hmm. Cultural intelligence. I like that. Cultural okay. intelligence. Generational intelligence. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Iba yan, no? Generational cultural intelligence. intelligence. Generational intelligence, which is like. All the generations from mm -hmm. the tradition yes. Yes. Uh -huh. yes. baby boomers, yes. Yes. Uh, uh -huh. X, X. F to mm -hmm. the millennials. Mm -hmm. yes. mm -hmm. There's also the thing called emotional mm -hmm. intelligence. Mm -hmm. okay. mm -hmm. Emotional intelligence yes. is basically yes. how you deal with others, how yes. you feel uh -huh. mm -hmm. for others. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. And then last is actually the social intelligence. The mm -hmm. social intelligence. Mm -hmm. Social intelligence. Mm -hmm. okay. It's actually how you conduct yourself in mm -hmm. a social setting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Social so settings. if you develop an awareness with that, say for example, you're going to a particular country. Mm -hmm. Don't go there without actually knowing or researching oh, about... Google lang yan. Yeah, Google, Google lang yan. Yeah. Yeah. No? Wala na ng borders ngayon eh. Mm -hmm. The oh. world has become uh, really small really because small. the availability of mm -hmm. information everywhere. everywhere. Now, cell phone nga lang, ignorance is no longer an excuse. Yes. Ignorance yes. is already a choice mm -hmm. with the availability true. of mm -hmm. uh, information around and us. And when so, you do that, sorry ha, but when you do that, kasi, let's say for example, mm -hmm. before you go to a particular country and then you research, mm -hmm. so that is already showing respect. Mm -hmm. True. You know, like 
Oh, um, identifying mm. the do's and the don'ts, identifying exactly. what to do and what, you know. Yeah, that's right. So mm -hmm. people, na mga magta-travel, mm -hmm. you need to research right. on the culture because different na. Tumawid uh -oh. ka lang ng one hour, two hours, iba right. na yung culture. Uh -oh. The way uh -oh. they dress up, you should also right. respect the way uh -oh. they dress of up. Course. Even the religion. Yeah, religion. Uh -oh. Like for example, for us here in the Philippines, you can go to the malls mm -hmm. wearing shorts, mm -hmm. slippers, mm -hmm. sleeveless, pag summer sleeveless. When you go to the Middle East, you cannot just go out like that. There's even a signage outside the doors of the malls that actually says you're not allowed to come in in shorts, like, you know, uh, plunging clothes, like, you know, so you, you should really do your little research before you go to a particular country. It's very, very important. I believe, I, I believe, Abby, no, that education also has a lot to do with education uh, okay. yes yes level be, of education yes being okay. kind and considerate because i realize when i encounter certain people who seem to be so rude mm -hmm. later i get to know them and then i learn that they were never nurtured by their parents oh, sad, sad stories oh, oh. and they went to certain schools that did not did bother not the yes oh. so i realize that certain people as they grow more mature, mm -hmm. will realize it only when it's pointed out to them. And that's why in corporations, it's so prevalent now that training is uh, very high up there in their needs because they do realize that some other people may be brilliant in certain aspects, mm -hmm. but in other aspects like Technical behavior. Knowledge. Yeah. That's so right. they don't even know how to deal with others. That's true. That's true. You know what, yeah. what's, what makes me sad? to find out that schools are no longer offering GMRC, yes. good manners and right conduct. Oh, yeah, no. During our time, they, yeah. we used to have that. Yeah, we used right. to have PERDEV, GMRC, uh -huh. Uh -huh. but not so much schools offer that anymore. Because now they are so involved in the technical. Technology. The world has become digital, you know, online, online. So now because of that emphasis on this, on this aspect, the technical, Oh, no, the they are not. Skills are yeah. The soft forgotten. skills are being for Exactly, right. I will have to agree uh -oh. because uh -oh. ngayon kasi, diba, typically both parents are actually working. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. So yun mga bata, mm -mm. naiiwan mag-isa right. or sometimes right. with the uh -oh. television or with the computer mm -mm. even mm -mm. worse, diba? Mm -mm. So doon na kumukuha ng values. Mm -mm. Ay, naku, oo yeah. nga, kawawa naman ng mga bata. Uh -oh. uh -oh. <laughs> Pero of course, so, how can we still instill? Let's say, for example, uh -oh. we have uh -oh. we have uh, the working people na. Okay, right. so working right. People now, uh -oh. how do we instill to them the proper behavior, or should I say, the civil, the civilized behavior? Right. How can we instill? So it's always the it's it's always the parents who are the role models. Okay. So instead of but shouting at each other, wala na sa bahay, uh, okay. out of the house, working situation, professional uh, level. Right. So it would still pay to give our children or our relatives or mm -hmm. friends some tips and guidelines, like. It could come in the form of a book, well, all right, yeah, or, yeah. or certain gifts that you give them that will have this, for example, quotations or on, even yes, movies. Yes, you know, to that, inspire. Right, them. right. So, well, sort of, you guide them towards the right movies to see, the right TV shows to see by That's talking. Right. The about, na may parental yes, guidance. Yes, parental. Uh, talking parental about the benefits. Control. Yes. Okay. So. In other words, while it is true that more and more our, our careers take us out of the home, but it's still the parents' obligation to see to it that you go beyond the home. Mm -hmm. So there are ways of doing that. That is true. Mm -mm. Now, may I, may I ask, what about that angel healing that you do, Lay? Uh, the angel healing is actually... It has something to do with behavior. It has how, how, to, how you it, see it, the world. Uh, yes, it has. Okay. Um, I'd like to hear that. It, it's more of the healing of inside, inside because, of healing. course, uh -huh. as we've said, like, mm -hmm. you know, um, image is not only what you see outside. Mm -hmm. How you feel inside actually mm -hmm. affects it your yes. out, outer Reflection appearance. Na naman I mean, eh, diba? Kaya nga yung mata mo, di ba? Uh -oh. Pag malungkot ka inside, kitang-kita sa mata, no matter yes. how much nice. you smile, uh -oh. kikita siya. Angel healing therapy is more of a guidance therapy. Mm -hmm. Guidance therapy in a sense, like, I do it with cards. Mm. It's like yung alam mo yung parang 
uh, the closest comparison ng ginagawa is maybe yung yung mga nag the tarot reading. Oh, okay. Instead of like that. tarot cards, I use angel cards. Okay. Mm. So depending on how you want to be guided, mm -hmm. that's how I'm going to arrange my angels. And I'm I'm not the one who's talking. Basically, it's just being just channeled through. to me. Oh. It's just through me. So I see. I see. Totoo. I think when uh -oh, we when uh -oh. we want to heal the outside, you start really healing mm -hmm. the inside. It's like getting to know yourself mm -hmm. well. Because in this fast phase of life, mm -hmm. sometimes we don't even know who we are anymore. Right, right. Diba? Ay, nako, this is uh, so interesting. Yeah, I but, remember yes. some, something. Some of our executive clients mm -hmm. actually have asked us to coach even their children. Not only stop the coaching with them, but some of them have hired us to coach their teenage children because for proper manners, right? Can I, I yeah, absolutely all agree. Because if you experience something good, you uh -oh. automatically you want to pass it on to right, your children. Right. Very, very good. Very, very interesting topics, but we have to pause for a short break because as we come back, we will have more to talk about. So be back, okay? <laughs>